LR the liberal redneck here. Coming to you from a country with a government that is actually starting to reflect the makeup of the people who live here and not just the few who own it. I have been saying for years that women were potentially the most powerful political force in the world and they are certainly proving me a prognosticator here in the good old U.S. of A. They have leapt into government at all levels and are erasing all doubt about their ability to handle the job. They are not alone. Men, too, from all walks of life are stepping up and doing their civic duty by representing all Americans. The old white patriarchy is busy crying foul, but our new administrators care more about the needs of the majority of people living in the real world and are looking at the patriarchy as a source of funding for special programs that address those needs via a new equitable tax program. Thanks to Democrats, the U.S. House of Representatives is the most diverse in the history of our nation and comes closer to representing all Americans than any that came before it. The breakdown is extremely telling. In the new House, Democrats have 89 women. Republicans have 13. Democrats have 52 African Americans. Republicans have one. Democrats have 33 Latinos. And Republicans have five. Democrats have 24 Jewish representatives. And Republicans have two. Democrats have 14 Asian Americans. And Republicans have zero. Democrats have eight LGBTQ members and Republicans have zero. And Democrats elected three Muslims, and Republicans elected, you guessed it, zero. Finally, we are beginning to have the kind of diversity in our government that truly takes advantage of what our country is all about. I have great hope that the blue wave begun in the 2018 midterm elections will continue through the 2020 campaign, and make our entire government as diverse and as in tune with the needs and wants of all Americans as is our current House of Representatives. It can be done if we all accept the responsibility of participating in the process and, above all, voting out the bad Republicans and voting in the good Democrats. You can reach me at the liberal redneck at gmail.com you can visit live with me, the Pagan Goddess, and the Progressive Christian on our weekly wrap-up every Friday at noon central on blogtalkradio.com forward slash the liberal redneck. Thanks for watching.